having two kids without access to daycare and preschool has been incredibly challenging. Basically, I feel like I'm not doing so well at work and not being as good of a parent as I'd like to be at the same time. So my kid's right here. <laughs> um, can I have another 10 or 15 minutes? Oh, Full-time daycare and preschool confers a number of benefits for kids, but also parents, right? So for parents, it gives them an opportunity to one, have a job, look for a job, maybe look for a better job, engage in adult education, all things that are really important for social mobility. Structure is important. It, it provides children with a sense of safety. The more structure children have, the less likely that they're to experience things like anxiety, or acting out. A lot of children are participating in online learning. And I think there's enough evidence to suggest that these things are just not effective tools for young children, at least. Those things aren't really like an adequate replacement for kids actually getting together and having peer interactions. For children and Parents and adults in general, social isolation is a big part of the increase in mental health problems. Access to high quality childcare is something that we want to be increasing. Integrating some of the things that children are doing during the pandemic, if they're engaged in more free play, engagement in physical activities and exercise, that those are things that then can be integrated into the structure of preschools. It's often said that play is the work of childhood, and I think the pandemic is teaching me that that might be true.